<clears throat> Hi everyone, it is me, Jordan Long here, and today I'm going to talk about, you know, you know, making a film from, you know, Salty Land, or known as a Kingdom of Salty Land. Now, first off, Saudi Arabia or Saudi Land is like the black sheep of the Middle Eastern lands. Why? As one, they tend to be have some have friendship with the four one rights in the four one kingdom, which some of the Middle Eastern lands do not have. And two they tend they also happen to back up is a uh, holy land in their war against Palestinian land which has been going on on and off for years and this is mostly how it goes like if you're there and you gotta be covered and have someone with you well you know they are a worshipful land and they got this law, you know, and their law is that women got to be covered. They can't be by themselves. So, in other words, you're saying, Jimmy, here, women cannot be trusted. Oh, it's not that they don't trust women. They just don't trust the men when it comes to dealing with the women. Oh, I see. That's what it's all about. Yeah, they can't trust men not to do the right thing when they're around women. You know how it is. You go to any one of the worshipful lands and they pretty much got almost got the same kind of laws almost. Yep. Well, isn't it true that Saudi land, the king is the head of Reich and the head of Lamo? Yeah, it's true. They don't have free. They don't got free arms of law moot. There is no lawmaking arm. The king is also the head of leader. The head leadership arm, also the head of the lawmaking arm. And as far as the law writing arm is, I guess he's the head of that as well. Don't get me wrong. There are hirelings and other wickers that head up other arm, other teams, or wickerdoms of the kingly law mode if you can call it that because some folks don't like to call it that you know and I guess you're right about that and it's not the first time I've been to Saudi land or Saudi Arabia or Saudi land I've been here on and off when many WWE yield shows you know were down here Starting in 2008 between FYL, you know, and a lot of folks gave WWE for having a working deal with them. You know, a lot of folks think WWE shouldn't work with them, you know, giving to their double standards and their laws and their set and their oversights and whatever. I mean, no land flawless, though. I mean, are they flawless? No. Have they made mistakes and did things that weren't right? True. You know. But it was WWE and them have their working deal. And folks can scave it all they want. It is what it is. So you're probably thinking, why are we down here in Selby Arabia again? Or Selby land again? Because the king and queen of the ring is being held down here. So that's why I'm down here again. And as you can see... I'm already clothed up, so they don't really have to worry because they've got that law already set up, already following that law. And as far as being with a man with you, well, I guess Zena's husband Cameron that would that would put another green for the you know row for that. Now you might say, oh Jordan, don't they speak Arabish, Arabic down here, Arabic, Arabish? Yeah, they do speak Arabish down here, you know, but they also do speak English down here. And things are written both in Arabish and also in English too, 
giving to the grounds that Selby land became free from the 4-1 kingdom. So yeah, there is some folks down in this land who do speak the English speech. Well, Jimmy Hart, what are you doing down here? Like I say, I'm a W spokesman, so I'm handling business for them and speaking on their behalf down here. And also, hopefully, I can do something. Cody Rowe's been looking for an overseer, so hopefully they he picks me. And that would be great, because that'd be cool to end my two-diff run with WWE as being an on-show overseer once again you know someone besides Hulk Hogan well the last two folks you were the overseer of was was uh, heat flader enticing uh, it was uh, Dustin Gabriel enticing kid yes you were right about that oh and Seamus O'Shaughnery too and Drew McIntyre for that one-off well that's it. If you like this film, then follow me over here at Jordan Long Fairway. <clears throat> and that's if you know, hit that ringer and bind. We want to know when the next upload, live stream, and shorts been done for anyone that isn't a follower. And if you are a follower, then share, playlist, and thumb up this film. And then watch the other film that I made yesterday over here. I, Jordan Long, or Jordan Mulan Long, and I'll see you later.